of drummers outside of Oakland City Hall in a festive mood as Oakland leaders celebrate City Hall's grand reopening. Oakland hosted an event to kick off the reactivation of downtown as more people return to work in person. Businesses are still recovering from the pandemic shutdowns. And as Jose Martinez reports, some owners are staying optim optimistic as they see more movement downtown. That's right. I'm in downtown Oakland where there is a promising sign of recovery for some of the restaurants that were hit hard by the pandemic. Among them is a Mexican deli that's right behind me that suffered a significant loss of clientele, especially from City Hall employees. We're talking about more than 50% of its regular customers. Now, with the return of some of those City Hall employees to their offices, they hope things get better. It's been a challenging couple of years for Noemi Perez. She owns Juice Joint Mexican Deli right at the heart of downtown Oakland. We're waiting to everything get to the normal or the normal we have before the pandemic. Her restaurant has been a fixture of the downtown area scene for the past 15 years. But like many other businesses, they were hit hard by the pandemic. She says she lost 50% of her clients when the lockdown began. It's very hard to see you don't make money for you. You just make enough money for pay the rent and the, uh, all the bills. But things are starting to get better. She says the restaurant finally sees the light at the end of the tunnel, especially since some city hall employees have returned to the office. We have a lot of customers from the city hall or from the city Oakland employees for the fire department. And, um, and now they start to come in back, but once a week or twice a week. Like Sonia Lara, a loyal customer, she works for the city of Oakland and comes here for lunch every time she's in the office. A lot of people lost a lot of clients. Some of the businesses are actually closed. Um, Noemi kept on getting herself open, which was great. And we use her, I've seen that we use her also for some of our testings and stuff like that. But it's been very, very, very slow because people don't want to come back. But Noemi says she's optimistic about the restaurant's future. Even though she has been working more than 10 hours a day, seven days a week, she used to have five employees, but now she only has one. Everybody needs the business, yeah. but we pay uh, rent, we pay all the taxes because we are on the downtown. And I pay employees and electrical and all that, so it's getting expensive, everything. Especially since she had to adjust her hours. Right now, her place is open from 7 a.m. to 3 p.m. We need clients, yes. <laughs> we, need, we, we need business. <laughs> a wish that could become a reality once more employees return to the area within the next few months. Now, Noemi tells me that she plans to keep the restaurant open and even extend her hours of operation if she continues to see an increase in the number of people returning to downtown Oakland.